Hello everyone, I am Torior and welcome back to Let's Play Hearts of Iron 4S Norway. Oh, why do I have planes here? Weird. I just left them, I guess. Okay, um, we have chosen a different path than we usually did in this, uh, in this playthrough. Oh, what is this? Oh right, I have I have this select these guys selected. Why is the sea green? Okay, this is weird. I don't know why this is being displayed. Let's change the map mode. Maybe it'll disappear. Nope. Ah, oh, doesn't really matter. We did send our tanks on a semi-suicide mission. Can I see? Oh, did they die? No. Okay, something's wrong with my game. I can't see my units. Maybe I need to unpause the game. Maybe it'll fix itself. What the hell happened? Okay, do I need to zoom in? Uh, I don't know what's going on. Why do I have this? Please move the mouse cursor over to one of the highlighted provinces to reshape them. Oh, I have... Ah... Uh, I have somehow activated the order edit mode. How do I get out of this? Okay, we did edit them. Can I... Can I get out of the mode now, please? Okay. Did I? No. Is it... God damn it! Oh, maybe I have... What, what is the hotkey for this? Oh, right. I had I had a key... Uh, a, key, a key got stuck on my keyboard. That is... It's fine now. Alright, is my tank dead? My tank is not dead. Actually, I feel like I should, I should get another one to do the same thing. Let's get another one. You are suffering attrition. You shouldn't be where you are, apparently. But you are winning the battle, so I'll let you... B, I'll leave you B. I'll take these guys. No, don't go through the enemy territory. Just go this way. And then go this way. Is this okay? Yes. Continue, continue. And you are going to follow a different path. You're going this way. And somewhere into the heart of Russia. And I will send you south, maybe. It'll be helpful. Who knows? Those tanks are pretty fast, so it, wouldn't, it shouldn't take them too long. Especially once they regain their supplies. Ace pilots. Perfect. Yeah, I could theoretically attack those guys. They should be destroyed quite easily. Do I need to, though? I don't need to, but why not? Let's do it and free some other troops up. Okay, we do have a free research slot. I don't really need to research anything anymore. I, I probably should install some mods that uh, expand the tech tree, because late game gets, well, stale when it comes to that. I guess I'll research rocket artillery. Probably not going to use it, but I'll research it anyway. Okay... I guess I should also take you and move along. Because there is nobody defending the area. Yeah, let's do that. The US forces that have arrived should protect our current deployment. Our current borders. Let's try and go for Beijing. Probably won't succeed, but we can at least fragment the enemy territory. And you go this way. That should get us some new options. Right. Let's get back to Europe and see how we do here. Yeah, to be honest, it is not the best. I could nuke some people. We do have one more atomic bomb. If I nuke you, that might let us do a breakthrough. We are about to take Leningrad, so I don't need to nuke them. Can I nuke you? Yes, I can. Here you go. Boom. It did help a bit. Not a lot, though. Yeah, I need more nukes. How's my construction going? Slowly. Well, let's finish those ports, and then we can 
continue making nukes everywhere. Or other nuclear reactors that will contribute to production of nuclear bombs. Okay, we're cutting into the enemy territory. Perfect. It will be a problem if we get cut off, but hopefully the US Army will help us and, you know, secure the area. Let's try to go behind enemy lines like this. Might work. Who knows? This tank is idle. You should be doing something else. You should be going... You should be going here and then down south. Maybe even to Korea. Yes, spread that front line. We will be victorious. Eventually. How's our favorite tank? Good, although you will miss this one province here. Now let's change his orders. Yeah, now we go there, there. No, no. Wrong. Yeah, just go over here. It's all one huge province. And go the northern route. I know, attrition and stuff. So hopefully you will take a lot of territory that we can use later on. Maybe some resources. We are missing resources for production. But I feel like production is not that important to us anymore. So I, th I think I'm going to cancel my trade deals. So we can construct nuclear stuff faster. Let's cancel our trade deals. Now we have more factories dedicated to construction. But we are producing stuff slower. But we are still producing it relatively quickly. And that is sufficient for us. Do I need this? Don't need this really. Okay, let's decrease this number, increase this number, it'll be okay. Do I need some more motorized? Probably not, but let's increase it anyway. Some more artillery, a lot more tanks. Yeah, continue doing these things. How are we doing? The enemy is attacking, but we're doing fine. I should have bombed Leningrad. Ah, I can actually do it now. Here you go. 158 freaking units. That is way too much. You shouldn't have so many units in one province. They're dying to attrition, all of them. And I can get expeditionary forces, but that costs me manpower, I think. So let's not. Come on, come on, get them. I could go back to scraping the barrel soon. Let's see how our tanks are doing. Yeah, pretty well. Hmm, there was someone here. Maybe it was you. You know what, forget that, go back, connect our territory so we do have supplies. And then you can cut north and connect with what the other tank is about to do. Hopefully they will have enough supplies to actually succeed in this. Alright, you need a port, don't you? Yeah, let's send the other tank after the first one. And you're actually going to just scour the coast. And hopefully get a port down here. That should do it. Yeah, and the US is bringing more and more troops. That is what we wanted. We do want them to press on this front. Whoops, this tank got separated. That is not good. Whose land is this? Uh, who owns this? You are against me. If I could take your capital, that would be very helpful, but I probably can't. Well, let's try. Let's try. Maybe we can do it. Those tanks are pretty powerful. Who are you? Show me the tank. Wait a minute, why are you not continuing your move? Did I cancel it? I might have. Continue your move, please. Okay, so how are we doing here? Give me that territory. This is um, an important province, so maybe we will get supplies from there? Will we get supplies from there? We are indeed getting supplies from here. Good. Okay, they have capitulated. 
mm, they might retake their territory, but if we move fast, we could destroy some of their forces here. And that will damage the enemy. If I can go to Beijing quickly, that will damage the enemy even more. So let's go here and then try to take Beijing. Uh, they are being attritioned. They're not getting supplies, are they? No, they're not, but I am. Maybe they are. Oh, I'm not taking su getting supplies now. Let's just so let's just stay here. This is an important province. It will help us slightly. You're moving quickly. Yeah, those tanks are amazing. Those are not in a very good situation, but apart from that, it's fine. Okay, should I nuke someone again? Did you take Leningrad yet? You did not. Come on, get me another nuke. I need them to be destroyed. Two more days, and we'll have one. It's very important to have this port. Here you go. Bam. You know what, I should give control of the territory to somebody else, but no, no. But then somebody else would get territory. You know what, I need to um, stock up on nukes and then drop several simultaneously. It will be way more effective. And I think this offensive is actually going to do much more than this one, because the Soviets have a lot of troops on this side. And not many here. And the US and China are pushing a bit. And so am I. Okay, so we now have... We now are connected. If I could press on, and maybe connect to China, on the other side, that would be amazing. So let's try, let's try to maintain the connection, maybe move my guys over here. I'll probably lose the important province if I do what I'm doing right now, but if we could go to Beijing, that would be very helpful. So I will attempt it. Oh. You're going over here. I should go back to Zhangbei, is that what it is? As soon as I can. Yeah, let's go back. We need to hold it. Oh damn it. They got there before I did. So we are more powerful, so we'll be okay. Go on, go on. Continue your move. Yeah, those tanks really are powerful. You know what, I should probably just st sit here. They will concentrate on me and I can defend it without too much trouble. How are the other tanks doing? You got your orders. And you are not doing what I told you to do for some reason. All right, let's get back to uh, Leningrad. Oh, cool. You actually deployed more troops in the area. Perfect. Maybe we can close this off and then we'll have a wider front. Or rather, a more connected one. All right, you're doing well down here. I will mostly concern myself with nuking people. How's our construction? Yeah, pretty well. I, I am going to get some more nuclear reactors. Because they are crucial to our plans. These areas don't seem threatened, although... No, I just took this. So nuclear, uh, nuclear reactors in there will get damaged, won't they? It's fine, it's fine. It is fine, I can still get them here. Japan, I don't remember which bits are mine. These are mine, certainly. I mean, which are mine, you know, all, I mean, for good, not just occupied temporarily. I don't want to build nuclear reactors for someone else. And I don't want to be repairing factories, because that will happen on its own. So let's prioritize the nuclear stuff. And then reverse the order of prioritized nuclear stuff. So that we can actually have the ones 
that have been, you know, the ones we started producing need to be higher priority. All right. And we're okay. The repairs will happen on their own. Maybe if we had better infrastructure here, the wall would be going differently. Let's see. Can I get better infrastructure here? Well, I did order those guys to do it. I'm not sure they will. I could get some more Newton naval bases. We'll get a bit of supplies their way. Those are not necessary. I could get some here. So maybe our troops can get, or rather our allies' troops, can get a bit less attrition. I'm not sure if this is how it works, but I think it is how it should work. Because all the ports have a supply throughput limit, I believe. So here you go. Also, some in Turkey. Yeah, it'll take forever before we can actually uh, construct these things. Okay, if I deployed an army here, that would be quite, quite useful. Still, what I'm going to do, should I prioritize constructing naval bases? Probably. Or rather, what I should really do is unprioritize all the repairs. Because they take a long time, but they will happen on their own anyway. So let's send all the repairs down the path. Yeah, all the repairs go down, and we construct the other things first. Uh, especially repairing infrastructure is important, but it is not more important than all the other things we're doing. Yeah, managing the queue is a lot of work. I wish I had more civilian factories. Right, good thing we cancelled the trade. It is not as important. Could we get our economy to a better level? Total mobilization. You know what, maybe we could. Decreases uh, recruitable population, but that is not really a problem for us anymore. Yeah, you know what, let's do that. Total mobilization. Our manpower goes down, not a problem. More factory production. Limited exports. If I went to free trade, back to free trade, that would buff my factories. And I'm not concerned and concerned with production anymore because we do have a lot of stuff and we don't have enough manpower to use it properly. So military production is not that important to us anymore. So what I'm going to do is go back to free trade. We will not have resources, but that is not a problem. Right, let's optimize everything for nukes. Free trade. As you can see, our factories will work much better now. See? Free trade plus 15% construction speed. Okay. How are our tanks? Yeah, you can just stay here. You can defend this place forever. These tanks are powerful. Hmm. You're not fulfilling your orders. Your orders were different. You're supposed to go here. I guess the US can help us advance this. And China, if we are able to connect. Oh! We did get Korea. Most of it. They're going to capitulate soon. It will go to China, but that is not a problem for me. Yeah, make sure to take all of this territory. And there was another tank that we owned in the area, you go and take the other line. And they, they, would, they will give up by this point. So we'll have Korea. China is getting the land, but it's not a problem for me. Uh, actually, they will probably take care of the infrastructure, so it's good. I do have a nuke. Let's see if we want to use it somewhere. Well, if our guys attacked here, that would be a perfect spot. Could you please attack here? Well, it might be better if I stockpiled more nukes. I wish I could... Oh, what's up going on? No, they're attacking the wrong bits. No, this is actually the right bit. 
I don't have air superiority because this is a different region. Okay, okay. Let's take these guys and assign them here. Maybe I can help this attack by nuking. Boom. One nuclear bomb will not be enough, but it can help. And maybe we'll be able to send another one. Democratic People's Republic of Korea has capitulated. Perfect. No, Poland, I will not accept expeditionary forces because I have no manpower. Great. Oh, this belongs to me now. Cool. So, your orders are to follow the coast. And then follow the coast some more. Hopefully our allies will cover all the land that we will have taken. And if we can connect our territory to China, that will be a tremendous help. Now the second army will go a slightly different route. Actually, no, do it like this. Hopefully we can separate the enemy from any reinforcements and this part will fall. Come on, US, do your thing. If we are successful, that will be wonderful. If. You. Who's justifying war goes against me? UK? We're in an alliance, so they can't do anything. I don't know why they would be justifying against us, though. Free naval dockyards. Um, I guess I can do more destroyers. Uh, we don't have resources. That means we produce stuff slower, but we still do it. We still produce it. And we have all our needs filled, so we're making... Basically, we're making stuff uh, just in case. Right, this goes to China. Not a problem. Yeah, those tanks are amazing. I do love them. If I had a third one... You know what, I could just go for Beijing. No, it's probably protected. Let's take the cautious route. Oh, they're going to take territory. No. No, we were fast enough to destroy them. Okay. Uh, Soviet Union commun communist and government. Eh, yeah, whatever. Sure. It doesn't change our government policies, so it's not a problem. Let's see the north. How are you doing? Oh, you did fail this attack, didn't you? Yeah, that's pretty bad. If we cut them off here, that would hinder the supply uh, chain and we could more easily get control of all the northern bits. However, it is time to end the episode now. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you again soon. Goodbye.